Oh wait, am I looking? Hey everybody, I'm China Eastern and this is my wall. It's not complete, it's getting completed. It's gonna take a minute, so you might see this for a little while. So like I said, with this new year, I'm changing a lot about my channel, which includes the content of my videos. I really love fashion and modeling. I'm a model myself, so finally, I decided that I was gonna make videos about New York Fashion Week and whatever else is going on in the modeling industry. I mean, I read Vogue.com almost every day. My email is blowing up, blowing up, blowing up, blowing up with Vogue.com newsletters. I have like three articles that I wanna talk about. Some of them are quite old. They're kind of from Men's Fashion Week, which was the beginning of February. So here it is. I was good on my own, that's the way it was. Janelle, I don't know how to say your last name. Janelle Okuwudu. 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 I'm just so grateful she wrote it. It's a really great article. I mean, she really went in. Somebody. You know, it's February, Black History Month. People are always like, man, why are you trying to make everything a black issue? First of all, this ain't about making a black issue. This doesn't just deal with black people. We're talking about the minority here. That could be black, that could be Hispanic, Asian, could be Native American, anything that counts as the other. So much of fashion kind of creates what people think is beautiful and you don't really see enough other races in fashion. I love what Janelle says. She's like, designers, they have like the opportunity to put more diversity on the runway, but they always give like this lip service of like, yeah, well, we're trying and you know, but nothing ever happens when it comes to the runway shows. Ooh, yes. Like she really brought like attention to an issue that's been problematic for so many years. There are like models out there who are making a huge difference. But I don't want it to just stop at them. You know? Like I want to keep seeing more like faces. And this article that I'm about to tell you about right now came out January 28th. So about two to three days before the diversity article. I'm so fed in love. She what the fuck you complaining for? Brad Allen is a male model to watch. Oh my gosh, I'm fangirling over Brad Allen. <laughs> I always try to click on things that says model to watch. Ooh, who are they talking about? Well, you don't really see that as much. Turns out this male model is Jamaican. Ooh, Caribbean folks. Okay, I'm not Jamaican, but my family, they're from the Caribbean, from the Virgin Islands. So I kind of feel like, ooh, Caribbean folks. So I was like, well, he's Jamaican. And so it was huge because to me, it's like, whoa, they said the male model to watch is Brad Allen, this Jamaican guy. I don't think I really see that that often. I love the article about needing diversity in New York Fashion Week, but we're getting it. And granted, there could be so many more designers, so many more casting agents and like modeling agents that could really look for more diverse models. I think public school is a perfect like example of what this article is like call to action. designers for public school is Maxwell Osborne and Dao Yi Chow. When I looked at their menswear collection, there was not any argument that could be made about you guys need diversity because they are diversity. Maxwell Osborne and Dao Yi Chow, they are of the minority community and I feel like they they bring that to the models that they select for their uh, fashion shows. Not that they need to do that, but it's like, you know, like seeing that on the runway it's great. So those are my thoughts about New York Fashion Week needing diversity. I think yes, I agree with Janelle. Yes, New York Fashion Week needs diversity. But I also say, let's shout out all the people who are representing diversity in New York Fashion Week while we have the rest of it to go. If you guys have any other thoughts about New York Fashion Week and this diversity, please Make a comment in the comments below and let's have a discussion about this. I love this kind of stuff. All right, see you guys next week.